Is it just me or has anybody else noticed that we're not getting any live footage from the Ukraine and the war that's supposedly going on there that we're sending all this money for? I remember Ashley Banfield in Afghanistan and Iraq and, you know, all those reporters that were over there. And we've seen the battles over there in Israel and in the Palestinian Gaza Strip. But yet there's nothing to speak of, of this conflict in the Ukraine. Are they not allowing reporters over there? Or are we just not covering it? Or are they covering it up? Because it seems to me like it's a lot of money. But yet, they're not showing us anything that that money is being used. We're not seeing any weapons being used. <laughs> However, I did hear Zelensky just bought a yacht. And I believe a Rolls Royce. And he bought his parents a house. And him a new mansion. And, and, he donated to the Democratic re-election of Biden. That seems awfully odd. He's sending money back, but only to the Bidens. And Congress and Senate wants to say that Ukraine is now part of the United States. So are we taxing them? Are they going to be sending us some of that money back in taxes? Because I personally had it. I don't, I don't think I'm going to pay any more taxes. No. I think I'm done. Because I'm not being represented at all. None of us are. None of us here in America are being represented by our supposed representatives. Just remember, in November, if we don't vote these assholes out, we're going to be done. We're already headed that way. I mean, just saying. Just saying. Let's everybody get our muskets and our tricorn hats on.